Albendazole is a broad-spectrum anthelmintic belonging to the benzimidazole class. It is indicated for the treatment of various infections, including the following. Nematode infections such as ascariasis, hookworm, trichuriasis, and strongyloidiasis. Cestode infections such as neurocysticercosis and hydatid disease. Mixed helminth infections, particularly in endemic regions. Protozole infections like giardiasis and cutaneous larva migrans. Albendazole works by binding to beta tubulin, inhibiting microtubule polymerization in parasitic cells. This disrupts vital cellular processes such as glucose uptake, leading to depletion of energy stores and eventual death of the parasite. It exhibits selective toxicity as it has a higher affinity for parasitic tubulin compared to mammalian tubulin. Albendazole is administered orally as tablets or suspension. It has poor oral bioavailability. However, the absorption can be enhanced if taken with a fatty meal. Albendazole is rapidly converted in the liver to its active metabolite, albendazole sulfoxide, which is responsible for most of its therapeutic effects. The drug and its metabolites are excreted mainly in urine and, to a lesser extent, in bile. Half-life is 8 to 12 hours for albendazole sulfoxide. Major adverse effects of albendazole include the following. Gastrointestinal effects such as abdominal pain, nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea. Hepatic effects such as elevation of liver enzymes and, rarely, hepatotoxicity. Hematologic effects such as bone marrow suppression, leading to neutropenia or pancytopenia. Neurologic effects such as headache, dizziness, or seizures, especially in neurocysticercosis, due to inflammatory reactions caused by dying parasites and allergic reactions like skin rash, urticaria, or rarely anaphylaxis. Contraindications for the use of albendazole include the following. Known allergy to albendazole or other benzimidazoles. Pregnancy. Contraindicated during the first trimester due to potential teratogenic effects. Women of childbearing age should use contraception during treatment and for one month afterward. Liver impairment and bone marrow suppression.